We can go to check. When you ride the, the wave, you are gonna see like the way the, the, the water coming up. These are so big. Gnarly. Whoa, 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 whoa. Today's a heavy one. We are heading out. Today's a little bit different because you can feel it in the atmosphere. You can almost see it in the atmosphere. Ciao grazie. Today could be the day. This is the best day of my life. Boys, 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 yo. Guys! Alright, All right, so a lot more action in the atmosphere today. This was dead flat yesterday. So, things are looking good. Should we get out and look for sea glass real quick? <laughs> Ben's here. I mean, yeah, we can. Right here? Okay, we just drove through the wilderness for like an hour and both expecting to see like nobody on the beach, like just a couple people. Now, this is a full-blown tourist beach. It's a scene. It's a scene. We might be able to get a, an idea of what the waves are doing at this spot. I don't know if the swell's hitting. <laughs> don't see. Okay, the sand is really cool. Let's look, ew, I look crazy, but look at the sand. It's like little pebbles. I just didn't feel right. Not, not eating sardines? Not eating sardines in Sardinia. Don't get the sardines on the blanket though, because oh, they're, they're so oily. It will stink. Ew! <laughs> you gotta suck the crema. So far, uh, good texture. You just gotta go fingies. Mm. Yeah, it doesn't smell too strong. They're probably good then. Wow, a little bit of a reserved taste as well, but kind of hits you after. And in the olive oil, it's almost a joke. Ooh, it's on the towel. We got it on the towel. <laughs> this is quite famous in that's the That's where I'm going, yeah. <laughs> so you what just... about tonight? Uh, there will be a really strong uh, wind, but I think uh, in uh, near Mandrio or Tosuiro, uh, there will be some nice spots. Okay, uh, the spot that probably we walk tomorrow, tomorrow could be too much easy for, for this spot. This is uh, mm, really beautiful for, uh, for do also long boarding. Okay. Uh, and this is boat. Uh, there is another one which is, is Arenas Beach, but it, this is the first spot that uh, become alive when the Nistra start to win. We have also some spot here in San Giovanni Sinis. But uh, when it's Mistral, it's not the best. Uh, usually, when it's when it arrives from southwest, could be also nice. Okay. This, and this is a, a big break. These are a reef with a rocky. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But uh, anyway, it's. Uh... Walking the cliffside of what they're claiming is going to be 15 to 18 foot seas. I don't really know what that means in the Mediterranean. Surfline's claiming it heavy, but we're really gonna see tomorrow morning what it's gonna be, because apparently we're gonna wake up to massive waves. And it's kind of hard to believe after being on this island, 
past few days and seeing what it has to offer, it's crazy to think that we're gonna wake up to big waves. So, not sure what to expect, but here we are, checking it out. All right, so the wind just picked up. Heavy. Heavy. It wasn't like this, right? So we might be watching this swell hit right now. Everyone's been telling us that in the Mediterranean, it goes from flat to six foot. That makes zero sense. <laughs> now I am interested to see what six foot is over here, but it looks like this thing's hitting. Heavy, heavy and hard. We're up on top of the cliff where the wind has picked up substantially. We're in for it tonight, Italy. There she is, the queen of Italia. crazy bull I'm doing right now to check the waves but this is how it is when you're a surfer and you're on a trip and you feel like you're running out of time to surf you do stuff like this now there's a, there's a heavy storm coming I don't know if we're getting waves tonight but apparently we're gonna wake up to 15 to 18 foot surf Marco said earlier today that maybe it'll be three meters, like 10 foot. So, I don't know. Got a lot of heavy claims going down. Wendy's claiming 15 feet at nine seconds. Surfline's claiming 15 to 18 foot. Marco's claiming three meters. I'm claiming, I'll be stoked to ride a wave. to say earlier that maybe people beach so heavy in New Jersey because it's a lot of Italians. All right, we took the counterintuitive approach. We drove against the traffic into the storm because on the weather radar, it showed that the storm was going to pass. And not that we have clear skies ahead, but we have less crazy skies ahead. They're actually looking pretty not so bad, but Look at this madness. I think my espresso wore off, so. I think it's kind of crazy. Like, they like wait to the very possible last second to leave the beach, even though they know rain is coming. It's pretty wild. Correct me if I'm wrong. I've seen a lot of people beach. And I, this could be totally off base. But in my opinion, from what I've seen, personal experience, nobody beaches as hard as the Italians. No, nobody. Absolutely nobody. I've never seen anything like it. They are beach, beach people. That's where I get it from. Even where you wanted to surf. That's pretty crazy. Not gonna lie. There's full on waves now. Wow. That's pretty wild. That Look is. at those waves. That is crazy, dude. Like, you can definitely surf. But now, do we have video of where the rocks were? <laughs> What if we just all like them fall? Man, no way. Whoa. And then up here, that was the gnarly part, right? No, the down? Where was the gnarly one? Jordan may not believe, whoa, look at that one, deep ball. I don't know if I'm gonna get another opportunity today, so look at the one on the inside right now, right in my spot, that one. That Crazy peeler left. That's scary, it's a dreamer. Okay. And uh, 
this is what we got right here. Dad's a so, dreamer. What's that? Me kissing memes? It's a great video. <laughs> <laughs> Your mouth is open. <laughs> so, heavy claims. Wish me luck. Recording on the handy cam. I'm wondering if the handy cam just makes you look tan or like I am this tan. I was panning too fast, it said. What? I was panning too fast, it said. Oh yeah, that's a bunch of bullshit. What does that mean? I don't know. I'm filming you. All right, this is the first film sesh on the handy cam. From here, everything looks pixelated and gnarly, but we're gonna go be good. Let's do our first zoom. Ben loves rocks. Scaring me. Jesus Christ. Well, something. Now, I guess that is counted as a cert, but it's giving me high anxiety. the morning of the claim. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Look at this, absolutely substantial. Gnarly. Crazy. What? It's just crazy, because there was, it was literally flat. Dude, just, those are bombs. This is a big weight. These are so big. Wish me luck. <laughs> it, it's gnarly out there. Just keep rolling no matter what. New place, new plan? Yeah, we're going to Alberto house. Oh, okay. okay. Traditional lunch? Yeah, I hope, I hope. <laughs> the, the wife is oh. nice cooker. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, Home uh, style. Uh, okay, I'm afraid, but I want to show you the place uh, if you come back yeah. where you can go. Okay. It's like uh, a hole. And uh, today, probably later we can go into check. When you ride the, the wave, you are gonna see like the way the, the, the water coming up. And uh, you see, driving, there is like a cave. 
like uh, you have to, to go under the water. Traditional. We just had an authentic, real deal Italian lunch, and that was crazy. Legit. The most legit thing I've ever seen. 21 courses. Drinks, appetizer, pasta, salad. What was the other thing? And then we had American, or Sardinian hamburger, fried fish, and then we also had, oh, and then salad. Then we had pastry plate. Then we had ice cream. Then coffee, and then lemoncello, which we don't drink, but the lemoncello, oh, I smell. you missed the ice cream. No, I said the ice cream. Okay. Pastries, ice cream, coffee. coffee. Lemoncello, like does after, which we didn't partake in, but we had our own version of it. That was, that was a lot, but it was delicious. Very, very delicious and very, very nice that they, they did that for us. All I have to say about that is, ciao. Ciao. You have not been inside the belly of the beast. I have. All right, now we're going surfing again. Heavy, heavy claims. Too crazy. What's the claim? Uh, the claim is uh, I see Ben Gravy right now. It's my <laughs> dream. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, this is, this is the okay. This capo is guided uh, in three sections. Oh, so it The conditions are really wild, but there is similarity to a point break going on. So it's our best bet, two and a half hours of light, and it's our last day in Italy. Well, it's our last day in Sardinia, so that's the claim. Might even ride fiberglass. Wish me luck. You.
Yeah, brother. What's the claim? That was fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. See you. Later, brother. Fifteen foot Italy wasn't exactly fifteen feet. It was more like five. No. Really? But there were some waves that I was getting video of that you were like here and then yeah. Don't be don't be putting it down. My, oh, well my, I have to put it down. Land. I have to put it down because like people aren't gonna think I rib if I don't say that the waves are small. What? Okay, so the yeah. waves were at least twenty. No, they were feet. probably like eight. Some Look at that, that's not five foot. Maybe that one's five foot. <laughs> <laughs> but we we did it. I'm super stoked. Thank you, Jordan. Now you complete another country. Yep. Good job. Next country I'll be at 10% of the world. That's so scary. What's gonna be your next country? Oh, when you do the big trip probably, right? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe if next If you go to another one, I'll kill you. <laughs> Mimi's needs you home for at least two weeks. But I just want to say thank you, Nub Nation, for the win. From the bottom of my heart, thank you for everything. Thank you, Italy, Sardinia, also known as Sardinia. Uh, Sardinia. Thank you. We met some epic friends here. Had a traditional Italiano lunch and just scored a point break. So I'm tripping. This is a wild experience. Thank you, thank you to my wife. Without me, you would never have come here. Thank you to the, the, thank you to Trani for the savior of the trip. <laughs> this $300 handicap. I felt so dumb with having it on the tripod. I just feel like an idiot. And uh, if you're enjoying the videos, please subscribe. Leave a like, leave a comment, and we'll see you next time for the dream.